Um, <clears throat> the strangest thing happened. When I woke up this morning, this picture was missing off the wall. And um, because I always look at it, I was gone. And I thought maybe David took it or it fell down. Um, and this, the strangest thing was that I had just heard that Jesus um, was telling mystics that we had forgotten about his sacred heart. And then I thought, it's missing. Boy, that'll bring your attention <laughs> to uh, the sacred heart when you have the picture there and all of a sudden it's gone. And I didn't know what happened, um, so I thought maybe somehow it fell down. And um, this little <coughs> bird was knocked over, and a few things were knocked over here. So I thought <coughs> maybe it fell down, but where did the picture go? Um, I looked around. I couldn't find it. It didn't knock down anything else. I think a card, maybe. But it wasn't, I couldn't find it. It wasn't anywhere to be seen. And I I looked behind the dresser. It's in a small area there. But I thought, how in the world would it fall behind the dresser? So I could not understand what happened. Um, and especially because there is this speaker that it would have to probably fall on first in this little little eagle. And um, so it just did not make sense. I even asked David um, when we were eating dinner, I said, did he take the picture or did he know what happened to it? And he said the strangest thing. He said... Well, I didn't intentionally intentionally do anything to it. I said, well, I know you would never do anything intentionally, like break it or anything. Um, but do you know what happened to it? Do you know where it is? And he said, no. And I said, well, oh, maybe you have to get, um, um, what do you call it, um, some kind of a flashlight to look behind the dresser. Um, and see if it just fell like flat against the dresser or the wall so I couldn't tell that it was there. And um, so sure enough, I um, just about five minutes ago, I <laughs> got the flashlight and I went and I looked down there and I could see it from, <clears throat> I could see it in that section, and I thought, how in the world did it fall? It had to have hit that little bird somehow, and then it had to have fallen behind the dresser, which is another six inches back, and um, I've never ever had that happen before. Or something just fell, a, a picture fell off the wall that it was hanging on and disappeared. <laughs> uh, so I was so thankful. I just saw the a glimmer of the frame, which was gold. And um, then I had to get it out because it was like in, in the middle area behind this dresser. <laughs> And it's a long dress or so. I got a broom and um, I was able to pull it with the broom um, far enough so that I could then reach my arm in and I picked it up and I said, oh, I'm so thankful because, I mean, I've, that picture has been there for like at least 10 years. And... Uh, I would have been very, very sad if I could not have found it. I, well, I would have put another picture of the Sacred Heart there, but 
I think it's Jesus saying we're forgetting him. Um, because at church, because of the virus, the COVID-19 virus, we have not been having First Friday devotions. And <clears throat> I think it's making Jesus sad, and so he's making me pay attention to the fact that we're forgetting his First Friday Sacred Heart devotions. And he wants us to not forget, not forget his Sacred Heart. So anyway, this was kind of something that first made me freak out. And now that I found the picture, it just makes me smile that Jesus would really let us know that he he wants us to do that, continue that. So um, I'll have to let David know because he was just as shocked as I was. He said, where did it go? And uh, so um, now I'm thankful because I really like that picture. I don't know if I could have found that same picture somewhere. Um, but I'm so thankful. And, um, okay, Jesus, sacred heart of Jesus, we will not forget you. We will not forget your first Friday devotions. And, um, And I, in fact, I put that little eagle right up to the picture. So, I mean, it should have just fallen on that speaker. So it was just strange, strange. So anyway, I'm, I might put some other nails to secure it oh, somehow. <laughs> so it doesn't fall again. It was, um, but... I'm thankful that Jesus sometimes lets us know different things and wants us to um, oops, not, not as easy to see it then and wants us to remember him and pray with certain prayers um, so just want to share this, and I hope that other people will not forget the um, Sacred Heart of Jesus and the devotions on First Fridays to the Sacred Heart of Jesus. Um, so we should just keep praying. We should just keep uh, honoring the Sacred Heart of Jesus the way we always have. And um, I'm still smiling <laughs> because this is just amazing to me. It's never happened. <laughs> and um, I'm just honored and happy to get that little message. Um, I think Jesus knew I would notice he was gone, and it was his sacred art picture, because I have other pictures, like um, I have Divine Mercy picture. Now that one, I, <laughs> that one's kind of big. If it fell, I don't know what would have happened. That would be kind of strange. But, um, and then I have this... Um, Statue of Jesus, and um, there's a beautiful crucifix, and there's a little crucifix under the painting, or the picture, of um, the ocean. And the bridge, there's a bridge. 
and none of those fell off. The only, the only picture that fell off the wall was the picture of the Sacred Heart of Jesus. So, God loves us. He talks to us in different ways, and I hope people start remembering the Sacred Heart of Jesus again.